Hi, hun again. I'm just looking at the clock up there because it's fucked. <laughs> No choice but to neutralize it. There are still others surrounding the area. Get out of there and head toward the village. Take whatever measures necessary to save the subject. Understood. Yeah, I might have to pause on occasion. Uh, yeah, that's pretty freaky. He's not a zombie. I might have to pause on occasion because I might need to cough or clear my throat or something. It'll only take about three seconds. Looks like they've killed a lot of people. I hope Ashley's okay. Alright, I have to pause, like, now. So, I'll be back in a second. Alright, I'm back. Don't worry, you didn't miss anything, unless you would have liked to hear me fix the clock for three minutes. Yeah, I kind of broke it when I was taking out the battery and put it back in, so I had to, like, push the face cover back into the actual clock. So the hands would, like, stop sliding over it and refusing to- Whoa! Turn around, and die. I'm used to the god hand controls now. Uh, that's just bad. That's even worse. <sighs> Normally I get reduced to uh, yellow health in this area. The fucking the first three guys. You die, all you fuckers. You better be dead. Now you're dead because I shot you in the foot. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, fuck off. I hate the enemies in pro because they fucking flank you. Alright, remember the dog Huey that I mentioned earlier? Take that. It's a wooden box. Looks like it can be broken. No kidding. Ooh. Okay, I never did that way before. I'm not going to bother saving because it's way too early in and I want to actually get some more of this done. Okay, stand here. Shoot that crow. If you shoot the crow on the signpost, the other one flies away. Yeah. Left one always has 200 posadas. Right one always has a hand grenade. Every single time. You'll never see anything different. This signpost means that there are traps just ahead. I have a bad feeling about this. Mm, nice one, Leon. This is Huey, the dog from Haunting Ground. You see a dog that looks like him in the village later on. Uh, I think it's just after the village fight. If you know what the village fight is, kudos to you. If you don't, you'll find out soon. Yeah, just after a Pueblo, actually. So, yeah. Same signpost as before. Could be a different signpost, but it says the same thing, so it could be saying could be different, I don't know. Explosive, explosive, bear trap. Stick to the left of this tree, and you'll be fine. Ball slash, ball slash, ball slash. Reload. Yeah, give me handgun ammo. How much do I have? Ooh. Got good healing items. Should be good for healing items, unlike when I got to Pueblo and I kind of run out of healing items. I had a yellow-red combination and just a red. And uh, I was on red health, too. So, red, 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 red. I like red. Red's my favorite color, to be honest with you. Looks like there's no... Uh, guess there's no... Ses uh, th 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 get the sentence composed before you say it. Guess there's no sex discrimination here. Say that five times fast, I dare you. Better find her fast. Yeah, better talk fast. You die. I said die. Yeah, that. Slash. Yeah. Alright, you can clearly see the three guys up here where my laser is pointing. You'll see them. We'll get to them in a second, but you can't kill them, so, yeah. You can't kill them. Don't don't bother putting any bullets into them, and they don't appear on subsequent playthroughs because you'd have a rifle by then and you would be able to kill them. I suppose if you used a trainer, an action replay or something to get weapons earlier, to like start with a uh, bit of bear rifle. Whoa, fucker. Then you probably could try, but it won't work. I'm I'm gonna I'm willing to bet money on the fact on the possibility rather that you wouldn't be able to shoot them with any weapon. And for those wondering what the point to completing professional mode is, if you're playing the GameCube, then there's nothing but bragging rights, and the fact that you can use upgraded weaponry and costumes and shit in professional. On the PS2, GameCube, and Wii, you get the PRL 412, and it's horrendously overpowered on the Wii version. It isn't on the GameCube version, but on the PS2 and PC, it's kind of like an alright weapon. At least it's actually there. I'll stop talking for a second. Leon, how you holding up? Got my ass handed to me. Sorry to hear that. I'm sending you a playing manual. 
Hope you find it useful. I'll take a look at it. Thanks. This setup that I got for recording videos now is definitely a hell of a lot better than the one that I had before, where I had the microphone in front of me, just in front of the speakers, and I had to basically yell so you could hear my voice. Okay, um, not keys, treasures. What the hell am I doing? Keys and treasures, weapons and recovery, map. Not the map either. What am I smoking? Come on, go, move. Yeah, don't care. Go, files. 8,000 posadas. Uh, playing manual one. Control configuration changes are not reflected here. Please pay careful attention to button functions. What is the time? Uh, it's quarter to four. Ready weapon. Right shoulder button trigger bumper thingy in case of my gamepad and press primary button that does stuff. Knife, left primary button, left trigger bumper, whatever the fuck it's called. Uh, perform actions. I'm fairly sure that the analog stick triggers and D-pad are not related to those action button prompts, but you know. Camera with right analog stick. Yeah, you get it. It's easy to figure out. Info on Ashley. Ashley Hotness. It should just say that and it summed up, sum, sum it all up for me. Name, Ashley Graham, age 20, daughter of the United States President. She was kidnapped by an unidentified group while on her way home from her university. The kidnapper's motives are still unknown, although there's reliable information that the perpetrator is an insider. Only a handful of people know about this kidnapping. It's been kept under wraps mostly due to the fact that we can't determine who the traitor is, and it's the president's daughter. The guys in intelligence say they have reliable information that Ashley's been sighted somewhere in Europe, but, we, uh, but until we find out who the insider is, I don't know what to believe. It could be a ploy. We have very few leads as to the whereabouts of Ashley, but members of the Secret Service and anyone else related to Ashley are being questioned by an investigative team. Even active agents are being investigated for any information. It's just a matter of time before the kidnapper is exposed. You gotta like that um, kind of thing where it has some kind of thing, our time will come, or the traitor will soon be exposed, something like that, at the end of a file or a cutscene or something that you read, because it just adds so much cheesy, guilty pleasure exposition to it. Control configuration, blah. This is the one that I just got from Hunnigan. Reloading. Press 1 while holding down 6 to reload. In my case, it would be 4, which, on, if you're playing on a 360 controller, it would be... I can't remember. I really can't remember. It would be X. Holding down, cough, right bumper. You know, oh, I should apply that mod. Damn it. Mm, nah. Use 5 and 6, i.e. primary shoulder triggers, bumpers, blah, 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 to change from keys and treasures to weapons and recovery. I can't do it because I'm in files. So, yeah. This is Pueblo. This is also Sparta. This is not madness, and it could be over 9,000. Oh, squeaky chair. Zoom, zoom, zoomity zoom. Okay. Uh, see that church? You go in there later. You won't go in there yet. Up there is kind of an objective, but I can, I can save it till later, but I prefer to do it now. Or soon, rather. Because there's shotgun ammo in there, you can plainly see. Um, what else? Oh, shut the hell up. They're yelling hey over here. Yeah, Resident Evil 4 taught me Spanish, and who the hell said games aren't educational? I'll shoot them myself. Mierda. And that means the yes word. Watcha! Alright, now run! Yeah, that. Bra. Oh, my. There will be an incendiary grenade in that right crate every single time. Good, no Ganados, keep running. Alright, here's what I gotta do. There are two Dr. Salvadors in this area. Dr. Salvador wields a chainsaw and has 19 health. He has 19 health in this area. If you go into this cabin here, the first one will disappear, but the second one will spawn. We want to kill the first one before we get to the second one for maximum money. No, not that. Could work though. You bastard. Bastard. Only do this if you know exactly what you're doing. If you're a beginner, don't do this. And that went off pretty well. That went well, I will admit. He should have a ruby. Good, he has a ruby. Yeah. Keep running, keep running, keep running, keep running. Okay. In this cabin, we will find a shotgun. 
and the second Salvador. I am Potetras. Go in from behind, he said. There's a translation guide on Game FAQs. Look for it. To kill you? I just killed a chainsaw guy and you worry about this one? Well, maybe because he doesn't have his pota blah, 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 potato sack on. Yeah, in, the, in this cutscene, you can see that guy's face. And he said to Voya Matar, because I was talking over it already. So we barricade this, just to get some extra time. We got plenty of time to go around here, get the handgun, and we break the barrels, get whatever in the bar get whatever's in the barrels, and get the shotgun. Preferably break that second one too. It's the end, la trampa. He's in the trap. 